Hello folks, it's a beautiful evening here in Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. I'm currently in the lovely little town of Mount Joy. Not sure how it got its name, don't know, don't know. But, beautiful little town. Kind of in the outskirts at the moment. But this morning started out interesting. I walked out the door with my two little dogs and I had just set my one little dog down on the porch and I felt something really sharp and pointy and ouchy. <laughs> ouchy is the operative term jabbing into the inside of my arm and look down and there's this bug of some sort about an inch long and it decided to bite me well I shook my arm off and it went wherever it was gonna go and I have no idea where it went to but never did figure out what kind it is I think maybe it was assassin bug or something like that and my arm immediately started to swell up to about the size of half a golf ball uncomfortable to say the least so my wife ran me to the emergency room <laughs> first thing in the morning it was great and it turned out it was just an allergic reaction to whatever the bite was apparently not a bad one thankfully I didn't end up with anything like a uh, closed up windpipe or anything like that thankfully although it was getting a little scratchy and so ended up basically being told take some Benadryl and here's a tetanus shot oh fan so my arm is burning down here and sore at the shoulder because of where they stuck the tetanus shot in didn't work out as well as I'd hoped, I guess. Thankfully, the throttle on this thing is light. <laughs> He's headed across the fields here. Saw something yesterday that looked interesting that i like to stop and look at today. As might be obvious from the name of my channel, I enjoy scooters. That used to be my way of getting around. I used to just have scooters, and I, I enjoy them. I find them fun. I saw one sitting there on the side of the road last night, and I said, oh have to stop and take a look at that so I'm doing that today there we go I'm looking for Hustler Road and here it is I'm hoping the scooter's still there I wouldn't be too shocked if somebody hadn't found it and bought it scooters right now motorcycles in general are kind of a hot item I got 135 miles to the gallon on this of summer gas I really can't argue with that and I put ethanol free in it because less chance of clogging an injector things like that since I've been running it with an ethanol free regimen keeping an eye on the filters and all that stuff it's been running pretty flawlessly the Grom is not a fast bike nothing small like this is fast I mean it goes fast enough for most purposes all right so coming up on a Heather also trying to sell a van oh that's funny little 50 cc scooter here that is a Kimco agility 50 so a couple of things with this bike the tires I already looked at the stamp on the side of them they're from 06 you got rust on the brakes rust on the caliper brackets rust on the caliper screws there's no rust on the plastic there's rust on the shock there's rust on the back rack it's been crashed there's a big piece there that's not good the rear turn signal on the right side here is broken if you look down inside the exhaust you can see it's been broke because it probably fell apart when it was hit it's probably carbureted carburetors probably all gummed up broken front turn signal here uh, somebody rattle can the front fender so be careful in this case they're asking a thousand dollars for the machine uh, they're trying to take you for a ride it might not be intentional but it's not worth that much when this bike was sold new it was fifteen hundred dollars this was a 2007 was available in late 2006 what is that 17 years later they're asking a thousand dollars for something that's been crashed i don't know people be crazy wonder what they're asking for the van i'd offer them 300 because you're going to be looking at at least the other 700 just to get it running properly and just to get it right it's getting windy it's getting real windy oh wow there Mr. Dove or Mrs. Dove not sure which it is I 
is a fun time here. I didn't even realize this road was here. Whispering Pine. Nice. It brought me out where I wanted to be. I mean, it's gravelly, gravelly, but okay. I like this. I'm going to get to take a picture of this barn. <laughs> Hello, cows. All right, well, have fun. All right, love you, sister. Bye. Well, it's been a beautiful ride. Thanks for watching. Be safe, be well, and be blessed. May the wind always be at your back, and may your wheels never be parallel to the ground. Scoot and fool out. <laughs>